Harvest of Digital Personnel Files enable the central electronic management of personnel files. Individual documents can be saved in predefined folder structures and hierarchies. Files of Digital Personnel Files can be purchased as an add-on to Files of Folio and used out of the box. We are now logged in as Karen Bauer. Karen Bauer works in the Human Resources Department and therefore has access rights to digital personnel files in the system. Access rights to the personnel files are role-based and can also be customised. The Personnel File Shelf The Personnel File Shelf is at the heart of the files of personnel files. Via the Personnel File Shelf, you can define various settings, such as the folder structure for new personnel files. Further settings include the numbering of personnel files, the predefinition of selectable fields, for example, available organizational units, positions, employment types, the available document categories for personnel files, the settings for the SAP interface, the settings for the creation of watermarks on PDF views, the available report templates, and the import settings. The personnel file shelf also serves as a root element for navigation and structures personnel files into three lists. The active list displays personnel files with the status active. These are all personnel files of current employees. The tab inactive displays personnel files with the status inactive. These are all personnel files where either the date of joining the company is in the future, i.e. personnel files are prepared in advance, or the date of leaving the company is in the past. And finally, cancelled personnel files are listed under cancelled. Read personnel files and personnel file documents. As well as documents, digital personnel files also contain important employee metadata. This metadata can be viewed under properties via the context menu. To improve clarity and ease of overview, the metadata is split into different tabs. A summary of the most important metadata along with a photo of the employee, is always available in the header section. With a double click, the personnel file can be opened in a new window. In this view, the employee's most important metadata and photo is displayed in the header section. Via the left section, the different folders within the personnel file can be accessed via a tree display. The personnel file documents are saved in these folders. Changes made in a personnel file are tracked in a full audit log and can be followed in a history view. The timeline offers the user a quick overview of important changes within the digital personnel file. When dealing with a very high number of digital personnel files, it's often easier and quicker to find personnel files via the special search portal, instead of navigating through the personnel file shelf. In the search portal, you can enter a search term and search for personnel files. You can then open the digital personnel files simply with a double click. The search term is compared against different metadata and can also contain wildcards. In this case, the personnel file is found because of the field position. You can access the user help for the different digital personnel file use cases directly via the user interface. If you click on the question mark symbol, the links to the help text are displayed. Alongside the general user help for use cases in Files of Folio, there is also a special user help for digital personnel file use cases. Create personnel files and register documents. Personnel files can be mass imported via corresponding interfaces, for example, import via CSV file. Additionally, personnel files can be manually created via the menu point New. When manually creating a digital personnel file, an employee's most important metadata can be directly captured. The personnel number is automatically assigned based on the settings of the respective personnel file shelf. An employee photo can also be saved, along with the metadata. The new digital personnel file already contains the folder structure defined by the personnel file shelf. Documents such as application documents can be easily imported into the relevant folder by drag and drop. Once the file has been uploaded, the document is registered and further metadata can be added to the document. At this point, the document is also categorised as a curriculum vitae. Three document categories have been defined in the personnel file shelf for the current personnel file folder job application. This is why these three are offered as selection possibilities.
access to your own personnel file. Fibersoft Digital Personnel Files enable you to grant employees access to their own personnel files. Furthermore, you can also grant supervisors access to the personnel files of their employees. To do this, simply add the supervisor's user object to the field supervisor and the employee's own user object to the field assigned user. We now switch roles and log in as Stefan Leiner, Head of Marketing. Stefan Leiner uses the personnel file collection to manage his team's personnel files. Via the search button, he can start to search and find his own personnel files and those of his employees. He therefore, for example, has access to the application documents of his employee, Bernhard Angerer. Part access to personnel files for other departments. The easy to manage and flexible security concept for digital personnel files allows you to grant additional people or departments partial access to digital personnel files. Let's have a look at this using the IT department as an example. If an employee receives a smartphone or a notebook, they have to sign a takeover confirmation, which is then saved to their personnel file. To enable this access, the department internal systems is given change access for objects with the category hardware. So through the assignment of this category to the hardware folder, internal systems is granted access to this part of the digital personnel file. Here we see that the department internal systems has been authorized for two further categories. We now switch roles and log in as Ingo Berger, an internal systems employer. Ingo Berger has access to the personnel files via the personnel file system. Within the personnel files, however, this access is limited to the folder hardware. Even the general information in the header section is restricted to the name and personnel number. This allows Ingo Berger to save takeover confirmations to digital personnel files without having access to the rest of the documents. Mm -hmm.